Welcome to this introduction to the uniformly loaded floor beam module in StruckHauk. You can access this module by clicking on the second icon in the toolbar. This module is the simplest of the 11 modules and is very useful as you can quickly design a floor beam, typically in less than a minute. I will give a quick example of an analysis with this module. Let's assume we have a floor beam we wish to design that has a span of 16 feet. This beam is supporting joists on both sides. On one side we are supporting joists for offices that have a live load of 50 pounds per square foot. We will use the default value for the dead load of 15 pounds per square foot. These joists are 16 feet long which gives us a tributary width of 8 feet. On the other side of the beam we have joists which support a corridor loading which is typically 100 pounds per square foot. These joists are 8 feet long so we will use 4 feet for the tributary width. There is a wall and bearing directly over the beam that is 9 feet tall with an assumed dead load of 10 pounds per square foot. This gives us a hand calculated value of 90 pounds per lineal foot of load on the beam. We can now quickly size the beam with auto size by clicking the appropriate button on the navigation toolbar. Let's first try sizing a glue lamp beam. Simply click the stress combination you wish to try and click the sizing button. StruckCalc will quickly give you the width and depth combinations that will work for this load condition. You can also check to see if a structural composite beam will work by choosing this option in the drop down box. StruckCalc will give the lamination and depth combinations that will be adequate. You can also compare options with steel beams. Highlight the range of depths you wish to try and AutoSize will list the lightest steel section that will work for those load conditions. You can now pick the section you wish to use and it will drop this section into the navigation toolbar. There is a checkbox option where area reduction is allowed. In certain live load calculations, the code allows you to reduce the live loads on beams that support an area larger than a code specified amount. You are now ready to either print the analysis or save for use at a later time. You can also preview the analysis by clicking the print preview button in the toolbar. You can see from the print preview that StruckCalc has confined the printouts for the analysis to a single page including member information, the deflections, the reactions, the section and design properties, the loading diagram, as well as the beam loading information. That concludes this quick review of the uniformly loaded floor beam module. Thank you for watching this video.